Hello Wobblies, welcome to Wobbly Otter Outdoors. I'm Chris and in this episode we're comparing two plow disc cooking pans. On your left is the Timbo Tusk Scottle and on your right is the Discata by Southwest Disc. Timbo Tusk is based in California, Southwest Disc is based in New Mexico. The Scottle we're looking at is the original because that's the one we have. Currently Timbo Tusk is making their Scottles with adjustable legs. First we'll compare cooking discs, then we'll compare burners, and finally the kits. The cook surface on the scottle is 18 inches in diameter. They also have an adventure scottle that is a 12 inch cooktop. This discata is 22 inches in diameter with Trinity handles. They also have 18 inch, 20 inch, 22 and 24 inch models available of various styles. Out of the box, the Discata has a slightly slicker and more non-stick surface than the Scottle. Over time, both will become more non-stick with use and proper care. Currently, the Scottle kit with adjustable legs comes with a Covea Scout 10,000 BTU burner. Southwest Disc offers two burners on their website, one of which is a tripod version that has adjustable legs anywhere from 18 to 26 inches in height. That burner is 65,000 BTUs. The current Scottle with adjustable legs, the legs adjust down to 20 inches at their smallest for a packing size, then they expand up to a hard stop at 29 inches and expand up to another hard stop at 36 inches. For our Wobbly Otter Outdoors kit, we are using a Camp Chef Pro 30. It has a 30,000 BTU burner and it has four legs that are not adjustable. Each of the burner leg combinations has an option in them to get the cooking height at right around 30 inches. The three kits we're going to compare are the Timbo Tusk Scottle Kit, a all Southwest disc kit that includes a discata as well as their adjustable leg tripod burner. And the third is our choice, which is a discata and Camp Chef Pro 30. When it comes to weight, the Scottle wins out hands down. At right around 15 pounds, it is easily the lightest of the three options. Second is the All Southwest Disc Kit coming in at 34 pounds, and the Wobbly Otter Choice comes in at a hefty 43 pounds. Here's how the three kits compare on price. The price of the All Southwest Disc Kit, including a cover for the disc, is $205. And the Wobbly Otter Choice, containing the 22-inch Discata and Camp Chef Pro 30, with bags for everything, comes in at $243.
the price of the Timbo Tusk Adjustable Leg Scott Oil Kit that comes with bags for everything is $375. A link to the price comparisons as well as all the other specs for these three options is down in the description below. As far as my personal impressions, the quality of both and the craftsmanship in both is very good. As for cooking surface, I prefer the Descada. It is slightly more slick and I prefer the deeper bowl that it has. The larger cooking surface makes it a dream to cook on. It's great too that the Descada has handles. I prefer the versatility of the Descada in that you can use it over a burner as well as over an open fire. You can use it over any burner. You aren't locked into one burner or fuel source. The Tembo Test Scottles are geared mainly toward those who are looking for a light, portable, all-purpose cook surface, and they serve that niche well. The Southwest Disc Discadas and Burner Options, because there are more of a variety of choices, anywhere from an 18-inch to a 24-inch disc, as well as a burner that has adjustable legs, they could go either way. They serve the market for the portable version, as well as something that's for more of a larger gathering. The beauty in the Tembo Tusk Scottles is that everything can come in a kit, so you get it and you're done. The beauty in the way Southwest Disc provides options is you can pick and choose which sizes of discs you want, which burner you want, and put together the kit that works for you. If you're comparing the two only on price, then Southwest Disc gets the edge. Our thanks to Jody, who in the comments of a previous video asked that we compare the Scottle and the Discada. We appreciate our viewers' comments, and if there's anything that you'd like to see, please don't hesitate to let us know. Down in the description, we'll put links to these companies and products. Thanks for watching Wobbly Otter. We love you, and hope all your tomorrows are bright. Until next time.